My name is Bridget, I'm the Head of Maths and Computing at Nexus and my CAS experience is diving and conservation. I got started with diving at my first school. Uh, somebody needed a volunteer to go on a diving trip so I volunteered and ever since then I've been hooked on diving and that's actually the reason that I moved to Malaysia was to continue my diving and I did a few long-term uh, conservation projects in Borneo and I've been doing that pretty much every year since I started diving. I was inspired to start conservation because whenever I go diving I always look underwater and see what uh, life is uh, doing underwater and I wanted to learn more about that and because of the global climate change at the moment I wanted to see what, what I could do to help uh, preserve underwater life. So I uh, participate in things such as surveys, so having a look underwater and seeing what sort of fish there are. And uh, in particular, I am really interested in surveying manta rays. So for me, I get to uh, practice my diving, which is always very exciting. You can do a lot of diving every single day for, uh, some people actually stay in these conservation projects for up to a year. Uh, for me, I do it during my summer holiday, so six weeks. Uh, so I really enjoy the diving aspect. Uh, I get to practice my underwater photography, which is um, really uh, a relaxing hobby for me. And on top of that, I get to learn more about uh, the underwater world and how I can protect it. And that makes me feel like I'm making an impact as well as having fun. So the main challenges are um, staying in very rustic places. Uh, normally there's no running water, um, there's no air conditioning or anything like that. So you're staying on an island uh, where you have to cook for yourselves, you have to um, form relationships with the people that are around you and sometimes it can be quite tiring, it can be hot, especially if you've been diving all day um, and you might uh, there might be frictions between people. So Forming those relationships in a group is quite important, but uh, the benefits that you get from it definitely outweigh the challenges. So if anybody wants to uh, look into diving conservation, the company that I went through was called Barefoot Conservation. So you can Google that, check them out, and you can see the sorts of uh, amazing work that they do.